I want to show you how to add feeds from the posts of other students' blogs very easily through an automatic system into your own blog. So I'm just going to use the Ed Research Seminar blog and I'm going to have to sign in. So I'm going to go over here and click on sign in. Let's click on sign in. And once you're into the dashboard, you can go into the blog and go into the settings for the blog. But actually what you want to do is not stay in the settings area, but go to the design tab so that you can get this look. Um, so you're going to want to add a gadget. So this is going to be a gadget that will do feeds from other blogs. So what we're going to do is click on add a gadget over here. We can add it up the top, but we'll just add it on the side. And that is actually going to list a whole set of different gadgets which we can have on our blog pages down that side but what we really want is a feed we want to add content from an RSS or Adam feed from my blog so I'm just going to click on plus to add that so what it's looking for is the feed URL and so that is the address at which the feed is so I've got to go to another blog another student's blog to have a look at where that feed is coming from and get the address of the feed so if I'm just going to click back onto where we were in the research seminar blog but go to my own blog which is uh, called uh, connect ted here um, and down the bottom of um, the uh, the blog after all of the posts there is a subscribe to command which is called the posts and the atom feed it doesn't actually have the word feed in it but that area there is what we want we want that address of that so that is actually the link location so i'm right clicking on it and i'm copying that link location so if i went to it we'd actually get some jargon uh, up here so some code but the address for it would be up in the address bar but I've copied that link location I'm going to go back now to um, to pull that feed in I've got to paste it into this configure feed widget and this is the blogspot address and now I just need to continue and it's retrieving the feed but it's asking me how many items I should display do I want the item dates do I want the item sources the authors and do I want to open the links in a new window no I don't um, it's showing me what the feed's going to look like. Um, certainly we can uh, agree that that looks pretty good at the moment. It's just going to have two posts. Um, and uh, click on save. And that will actually pull that widget in to my um, blog uh, in, the, in the window at the side of the blog. So that, that will add, add the gadget. And I would need to add further ones from every other student who's um, got a feed coming into their blog. So to have a look at that, I just need to um, go back out to the view blog. Um, so I just go out to view blog just to have a look to see what it looks like. So it's the Ed Research Seminar. And across on the right hand side is the a couple of posts from my blog, Connect Ted. Um, and uh, so if I want to go to those posts, I can s s click on the link and it will actually open the, the post having just seen a bit of the feed. Okay, that's how you just add some feeds from other student blogs.